one. Here we have a demonstration of cold cathode lighting. Originally when the neon tube was invented it was a follow-on from a lighting device made by Peter Hewitt or Hewitt Cooper which was a special type of lamp which had to be start, started by tilting it. Um, he sort of led the way for further investigations. The neon tube as we know it today was invented by a Frenchman, a Mr Claude and um, his name lives on in France under a brand of uh, light bulbs. Anyhow we can do it today by using a normal tube. This is um, a bit closer to give you the wattage and that. It's called a Duralight True Light 20 watt preheat trigger start. It's a power twist made in USA. Here is, is the old faithful. Let's give it a try. All I've done is to wire the output out one wire to one end and another wire to the other end. The heaters are not being used. They're not needed. Let's see what happens when, when we throw the switch. As you see the light comes up. Flickers. It's not steady, but that is a basic form of cold cathode lighting. And it's a form of lighting which seems to be coming back. In England at least, uh, lots of cafes are now using it, normally in red and blue tubes, they, and they're very, very long tubes. But there are quick demonstrations of a normal fluorescent tube being lit by high voltage. No starter switch, not needed. Any, any questions please ask. Thank you for watching.